Prince Harry's close friend and TV presenter JJ Chalmers, 35, has spoken about the pair's bond. He explained the relationship between his own children and 37-year-old Harry's. Discussing the origins of their friendship, JJ said they started off as young lads in the military and have since moved on in life and adulthood together. Speaking in a recent interview about a dad chat they had together, JJ added that their children hadn't yet had a chance to hang out. The Invictus Games gold medalist began by thanking Harry for creating the Invictus Games, an international multi-sport event first held in 2014 for wounded, sick and injured servicemen and women. It came after the public speaker was severely injured in an eye blast while serving as a Royal Marine in May 2011. Speaking to Radio Times in his most recent interview, JJ said, First and foremost, Harry, created the Invictus Games, which inspired my recovery, changed my life and introduced me to the world of broadcasting. We've developed a relationship and he's someone that I look up to and respect. I've been through some pretty extraordinary times with him. In some ways we've grown up together. When we first met, we were both young lads in the military. It's been pretty lovely to move into the next stage of our life, marriage, kids, together. Now that we both have kids, we just do dad chat. I know that Archie loves the Octonauts and my son James loves it, too. The kids are a similar age and have similar interests. He concluded, saying he hopes the pair's kids will get together one day soon. In an interview from April with Big Issue, JJ spoke of how grateful he was for his friendship with the Duke of Sussex. He referred to the royal star as one of the key people who created one of the key catalysts in my recovery. JJ explained at the time, I listened to the royal wedding, William's wedding to Kate Middleton in 2011, on a wind-up radio in Afghanistan. Dot seven years later, I was at a royal wedding, of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. How that happened is utterly bizarre. Harry's a friend of mine and someone I dearly love and wish the best for. I wouldn't be here talking to you if it wasn't for him. He added, not to lay all of it at his feet, but he's one of the key people who created one of the key catalysts in my recovery. For that, I'll be forever grateful. When asked what he would advise his younger self for a better life, he said he would have prepared his family and friends for the incident which left him badly injured while serving in Afghanistan. Of the experience of waking up from a coma he explained he felt he could have been more honest. He attributed the resolution of his health woes to his family and friends, surgeons and doctors. The former soldier said it felt as if he was born again. He meant it literally, too, as the TV personality had to relearn how to walk, how to eat and how to do everyday functions.